Please not inventoring gear. Yeah. So no, I you use pittance because there's actually no way to have bought the not even inventoring gear, even though the book mentions a lot. Yeah, they're not yeah, inventoring gear. All right. Uh, right. Okay, now what artists? Oh, uh, that's. I suppose I could. I suppose I could hammer some iron spikes around this this trap. Stop it. Stop the floor opening. Wedge it shut. Would that work? Could you actually? How? Well, if we if we hammer iron spikes to the seams around, then it won't be able to open. Be able to um... fall. It could drop down and then open. Uh, sure, if you think it. I, I, let's. Should we just? I think the it's gonna take a lot for a whole floor, though. Like I ten. suggest we just trigger it and then find a way open the uh, over the chasm. Yeah, I, I'd say that's probably fair as long as it doesn't release some toxic fucking gas. <laughs> we aren't trapped inside. Should we all stay together though? If everybody groups up behind. Why don't um, I go and trigger it and then? But it'd be attached to a rope or something in we case. Just use mage hand. Just use mage hand. All right. That yeah. also makes sense. That's why I'm standing up. where I am. That's thirty feet. Remember, okay, that great. was one of the rules. We, for physical stuff, we mage hand everything, unless unless we need more force, then we can use the ten foot pole. Yeah, I agree. And okay. then Nina can magic. All right, guys. If Nina, I mean, if CL doesn't see magic, then I will mage hand the just lever. Wait for, yeah, I just guess wait for. Do you want to get closer? As Nina? soon as you cast mage hand, you see magic. <laughs> <laughs> it's like there's, there's an octopus. Carmen. <laughs> Stand next to Indra or something, Sabrina. Yeah, I'm moving. Oh, some, that's on, on top, top of someone. Of... There you go. You wanted to just be on top of Dragon Bait, didn't you? Well, oh, I can see. Like slippery so scales. Ew. 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 Lock and what, what were you asking about spider climb earlier? Oh, you can't uh, spider climb everyone, can you? No, I can only do Does one person help? at a time because it's concentration. So you can spider climb other people though. If you it's a touch though, so pretty oh, OP, God. wouldn't it? I'd rather not. I'll, I'll pat you on the head and then you turn into a little spider, Tilly. <laughs> oh, and you'll lose your hand if you pat me. You're being there. serious. <laughs> I'll just pat, pat you on the head because you're in front of me. <laughs> are, you, are you just made China, made China leave it then? Yeah, we're waiting for you to say if there's any magic. Sorry. Oh, know? any magic? Oh, yeah. uh, no magic. No magic. Okay. <laughs> Clonk! Alright. Uh, there, there is a sound of like uh, machinery. Um, and the, the the floor swings open, revealing uh, a, pa a pit full of bikes. What if I put it back? Does it close it? Then it closes. <laughs> ah, okay. So no, no movement on the door though. The door does not appear to move. Okay. So uh, explain to me so the wait. door. Go on. Okay. So if I open it. Uh, um, no, we no, we don't have a second person to like hold it underneath. I was thinking I could then slowly like close it again, and then somebody can slip the immovable rod underneath. So it doesn't. It yeah, would... but if yeah. the door doesn't open, it doesn't make sense. There has to be another way. Yeah. Luckily, we can close the door, close oh. the trap door any time. Yeah, I'll, I'll close it again, and then maybe we f we want to investigate the door up, up front. I would like to investigate the door. I think it might be safe for me to I think that. I th think Owen should investigate the door. Yeah, I think yeah, so actually, too, because yeah, he can fly. Mind. Just just walking towards the door. Um... Uh, uh, excuse me. Uh, pardon me. Excuse, sorry. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, that's tight here, isn't it? Oh. <laughs> um, as, as you get to that part of the floor, the, uh, the, the skull set in the top of the door, so you might remember there's a... Uh, uh, engraved skull at the top of the door and then a lever set into the bottom. Um, its jaws creak open and a skeletal hand holding a crystal hourglass style timer emerges from within. With a click, 
the timer rotates and sand starts to trickle into its lower globe. Ten. Nine. Can I open the door. <laughs> How are you opening the door? I can I can do the the lever, right? Pull the lever. Yeah. Uh, can I before I do that, I'm just gonna have to take a second to have a investigation, if that's all right, to see if there's anything suspect or something new. How long does the investigation take? I don't think you have time, do you? Well, six seconds. Six, six, six do, seconds. So. Yeah, you can you can have investigation. We're at eight, so probably like three seconds. Investigation. Boom. Okay. Um, you do not see any any additional details. Cool. I may as well give it a go. Pull that lever. Pull the lever. Actually, wait a second. It might be just trying to force you to do the lever. Fuck that shit. I'm not going to pull that Three, lever. Two, nah. two, one. No, no. Understandable. Understandable. Now what? <gasps> uh, the lever and the sand timer retract as the door sinks to the floor. <laughs> it was like a bluff. It was like a bluff. Oh, wow. <laughs> Oh, it did! Oh, I'm still scared to go. Um, I'm like, it's all right, guys. Okay, I Tilly's can gone. Definitely right. do this. Yes. <laughs> nice, nice. Oh, okay. Um. All right, let you guys up. Okay. Yep. <laughs> did you move the balls on to Owen? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Formation, everyone! Formation, formation. Uh, I'll, I'll get rid of the balls. Oh, get yeah, but sorry, I'm here, aren't I? Artist, back! <laughs> oh, look, that definitely doesn't look like arrow slits or some form of, like, slicing stuff. No, <laughs> right. I... A moss-covered co corridor extends beyond the set door. Tree roots hang from the sagging ceiling and the air reeks of rot and damp. Ahead, a base relief carving of a bearded devil's face adorns the wall at a T-shaped intersection. The devil's open mouth is a well of utter darkness. Uh, uh, can we, uh, I changed my mind. Let's, let's not go in there. <laughs> it is a let's, silly place. Let's go home and let's just go back to Ponyanzara and have Tilly. a nice bath and temple soon. Let's get some drinks, you know, let's just forget any responsibility. <laughs> all right, all right. Tilly, do you see whether or not these are arrow slits? Do they look like arrow slits? I'm on it, I'm on it. like, Holy from shit. where I'm standing, it, it looks like it's actually just little... Indents. Indents, yeah. It could be, like, where scythes swing across. Please, please ah. wait. P pending, pending um, do, do you want to? Well, oh, you rolled a perception. Sorry, I didn't see that. My bad. Um, yes, uh, yes, there are. There is. There are tiny holes in the walls, on either side of this corridor. Okay, guys. Well, moss is obscuring some of them, but but you can see them. Yep. As in like dart holes, or as in like a slit? Uh, yeah, they they definitely look more like dart holes. Right. All right. Uh, Oh, what do you... Uh, I guess you would also see... Yes. Yeah. Um, there are some irreg irregularities. as a 23, right? Yeah. <laughs> some irregularities in the floor's tile pattern. Um, you're, pretty, you're pretty sure um, that you can spot pressure plates here. Yeah. Here. Uh, yeah, so uh, Artis will, will hammer some iron spikes into this door as well. This door uh, raises rather than lowers, so he's only going to use two. Okay. Uh, uh... For each side. Okay. So, just, so we'll just avoid the uh, pressure plates then, guys? I suppose. Should I, I mean... use my pole? Yeah, do that. Just see what happens, I guess. If you tap everything that's not the pressure plate, make sure it's okay to stand on. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's Otherwise, what I, would, I prefer I'd have you to do. That. Jump from pressure, pressure plate to pressure plate. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the safe ones, guys. So you, you oh, use your iron pole to like push down on the tiles, which you, which May has said are safe. Yes. Uh, within within ten feet of you. Yeah. 
and I will progressively move forward as I do that. Okay. Do we want to okay, wait so for Tilly to do that, and then you're you're, st you're stepping on the tiles which you've pressed down on, and nothing has happened. Exactly. Yeah. Also, okay. did CL see any magic? Let's check. check. Oh my god, we're so cautious, aren't we? It's hilarious. It's good. Like it's the only good. way you're going to survive this. <laughs> yeah. Well, you, well, until we get into a fight, and then it's just uh, uh, thirty <laughs> foot, right? Okay. No, you don't see any magic, CL. This is, okay. all, this is all so, crap territory. The annoying thing is I could jump over this whole thing, but I oh, should stand fine. on them just in case. Yep. So I get hit rather than anybody else. Okay, so I I progressively move forward and do the same and try to hit everything that's not a pressure plate. All the okay, so far so good. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, you haven't you haven't noticed. Yeah, I guess the uh, it's based on the squares. Yeah, it is. Oh, that's I see. Diagonal. Oh, God, that's annoying, isn't it? Um, I can step over that fine though. I'm sure. Yeah. Uh, May May's gonna May's gonna follow her. Uh, you know what? This might me. You're gonna remove the grid, the hex grid. No, that wouldn't make sense. Oh right. Okay, fine. That would make. Oh, Kim actually has it lined up for himself. May is because May can see them very clearly, and she's seen that Tilly has gone through. She's just with her nose pinched a bit. Okay. Actually, she, no, she would never nose pinch. She'd just be like, just shaking a bit. I'll take one final step forward and see if I can see and anything. Dart quickly, like oh, into safety. Whew. All right. Hello. That's is it. it safe over there? Is there enough room for us all? Uh, yes, but we won't we won't be able to. I've got to I've got to read some descriptions for you. Okay. Um, now you got this this T section. Yeah, the statue it doesn't look great. All right. Uh. So over to your left there, you can see um, a rusted iron grate set into the corridor floor. Uh, through its bars, you see muddy water flowing slowly past. Um, and then uh, creepers and vines cling to the walls of this corridor, this uh, west westernmost corridor, at the end of which is an arched crystal window six feet wide and ten feet high. Through it, you can see a dark chamber. Is that on the right? On the left? Left. Left, okay. So there's the grate and the window on the left. Yes, it is. Yeah. Uh, you can see into... Uh, I don't know if there's a special description. You'd, you'd have to get closer anyway. Just to look through that window. Um, so, uh, on, yeah. So on the right is what looks like um, like a, a, a banister, uh, and then and then a big a big gap of darkness. Uh, so we don't know if it's stairs going up or down or anything. No, you can't. You can't tell from where you look. Okay, let's uh, let's get all over here. Let's all get over here. I I beckon to everybody to come over. Come on down. Can I wait? Can I just have them? Can I just put my hand up first? Let me just double check this, that everything around this area is traversable as well. Because people get so excited to stand it and then relax. That's not sure. Thing. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Just this T section corridor. <laughs> um, yeah, there's there's no traps, no pressure plates, anything along. Okay. Safe, safe for I people. I think it's safe, guys. Do you want to? Maybe CL first. Yeah. Want to check to see if there's anything magical in this particular T T section. Okay. Um, CL. Yeah. I mean, Owen can come over, obviously, because he's. He can fly. He can fly. <laughs> yeah, I'm. I'm like just gonna be a bit frugal with my spell slot, uh, staff spells, yeah. just in case I need it later for. Walk situations. like us normal people. <laughs> yeah. Just. And by us normal people, I'm not including. Oh, them. is it lagging for you? I thought this map was okay. <clears throat> oh. 
they're not they're not good. It's actually oh, not it's okay. okay. Is it okay? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay. Um so as you advance you do notice illusion magic on this devil's face. Hmm. That's an illusion, Nina says. Who's Nina? Nina. I don't know who that is. <laughs> okay. Uh, so that's an illusion. Let's get people to come over and have a look. I'm just like pointing to the spots not to stand. Like, just not that one. Yep. Oh, and the, you can just, you're just shutting off now. now. <laughs> Did you change the shadows or something? Because I can see further. No? Something changed. I think uh, Nina came. Is that me? No, it's it's it probably Nina came up. Could be Lena's light from her. Uh, from her flame tongue. Is it super bright? Is it that it's, bright? Holy it's shit. very flame tongue. I think it's very bright. Yeah. Fuck. I check the radius. Flame tongue. Yeah, that's so bright. You're so bright and loud. Sorry. Sorry uh, smell really bright. Yeah, it sheds bright light in a 40 foot radius and then additional 40 feet of dim light. Uh, so, uh, yeah. It's so, better than a uh, moonlit. Yeah. Stroll. Yeah. Um, if you don't want to do that, uh, you, know, you can, because it's your packed weapon, you can actually dismiss it, I think. Um, so if, if in future you need you need to make sure there's no light, you can you can just do that. Just let me know. Stealthy. Mm, it's good, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, okay. Can you uh, just speak a word and then like turn it off? Uh, uh, it's by the by, but. Uh, yeah. No, you're right. You're right. Um, you have to speak the word to to get the flames going to do the fire damage. Yeah, but you can you can dismiss it as the bonus action. <clears throat> Coming, coming across. Okay, so um, yeah. you, so looking through the window now with the light illuminating this corridor, uh, this this chamber. You can see, uh, this this vaulted tomb is overgrown with moss and creepers. Stone sarcophagus rests on a stepped dais in the middle of the floor. On the wall behind the sarcophagus, two large statues of bears grip a five-foot diameter bronze disc bossed with a dozen glaring eyes. Six desiccated corpses. Uh, you see two, I think, at this Slump on thrones in niches along the walls. Each corpse wears a black mask made of papier-mâché and feathers. An arched crystal window to the east, which is... There is an arch crystal window to east. You're looking. I investigate this grate before I move any further. Sure. I just want to make sure that it's totally safe to yeah. move job. across it. Are we interested in checking out what this illusion was as well? Oh yeah. We should do that. Although I don't know what what are we gonna do to like we know it's an illusion, but I could investigate it uh, as well. Or you should I hit it? Should it I just hit it with my pole? Well, normally with illusions, right, like if you touch them or in some way you can see through them, they become that, kind of transparent. That is an illusion, but it's illusion magic, right? So it's just illusionary type magic, you would think. So you have a go, but it might just be that it's something That's else needs to pole. trigger it to disappear. But it, otherwise, it's... Mage hand uh, first, in case it's electrical. Okay. Oh, I will. Mage hand. hand the bearded Did we want to be and immediately the in front of it? Well, no. We could move to the east. Yeah. Uh, if it's if it's easy, and then we can like poke it in its face. Did did Maze not find anything? With I'm waiting. I'm waiting for Kim. Um. To... So it's it's the same. That I mean, you can see muddy muddy water underneath it. Uh, the bars look um spaced look like they're spaced widely enough for a small size small creature could could squeeze through. Um. They look, they look pretty sturdy though, so likely to bend or break them. Um, you could potentially lift the grate up, you feel, but it looks extremely heavy. Mm, okay, great, all right, <laughs> great. <Okay. laughs> Didn't even mean to do that. Okay, so uh, shall I? We stand in this corridor. Yeah. Because like 
something could come out of the grate. <laughs> yeah, I mean... I'm assuming you know, that you've, you've had a look down this corridor. I suppose. Uh, May has me. Okay. Look down. Yeah. Just okay, guys. It's safe, it's safe. It, it's yeah. safe to walk along anyway, yeah. yeah. Um, so now that you're, you're closer though and you can see... Um, read for you. Uh, a grand chamber opens up ahead. 50 feet across and plunging down at darkness below. A stone balcony winds around the walls um, to connect four archways. Other balcony levels are visible below with corridors radiating off in all directions. To the north, stone staircase descends to the lower levels. A hunched figure glares up at you, Carmen. From the balcony below, wearing a mask that is a replica of the devil face at the tomb entrance. Without saying a word, the figure steps out of sight. Ah! I just saw something! I'll step back. Was step it back. here? What did you see? What? It was... See? no, it, it was It was like here. Uh, no, like, I don't... I can't see you. I Imagine there's... See what black level? Black it's on me. a different level balcony then. It's on the, it's on the level just below this one. Yeah, but like, um, were you like hearing my anything? my sight ends. Whoops. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah. I mean, CL is around the corner. She just it's off. Sorry, I can't. Like, oh, okay, I see it now. <laughs> so, is it just common that sees I see, it? I see a skull. Just common. Ignore, ignore the skulls on the map. They're not That's important. <laughs> right. Oh shit! They're not important. I, I have I have the players. I'm using the players' version of the map, but for some reason they kept the skulls in. They're, they're, they're not that. They're not that important. I know they look very ominous. So spooky. I'm okay. not. I'm not even like trying to to throw you off. It really is. <sighs> Don't stand on the skulls. Okay, so I I will repeat to you guys what I saw. You won't. She will. She's no, she. she oh, will. I can't. <laughs> you will. It's like I want you all to die, including myself. <laughs> so I will Sorry. not share it. I yeah. thought I heard you say. I was like, oh, I'm not too. So, yeah, uh, we. Okay. Uh, well, that's worrying. Uh, I, was just, I was just making space for more people to step over because you're right next to that thing. And it looked yep. like a, the. It was a wearing thing. a mask of the. Face yeah. The... Did you say mask? Yes, and it saw <laughs> me, and it left on the mask or beast be or oh, beast there's another person that didn't like Carmen's face Jesus. All, all, all the uh, corpses on the other side are wearing masks as well don't have a mask or beast yeah. we need some kind of how mask how many people oh, were in that other chamber six, six. that's a lot of people I mean, you can only really see two but if you go up to the window you but can see they, all six they were visibly corpses weren't they yes desiccated like coconuts. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. So we'll we'll deal with that when we find out what it is. Should for first things first, should we mage hand this uh, bearded devil? Are you yeah. okay with the position you're at, all yeah. of you? Okay. Then I will mage hand and stroke his beard. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like. Um. The mage hand doesn't pass through anything. The the mask itself does not appear to be illusion. It's properly carved. Poke okay. him in the eye. I'll poke him in the eye. About the mouth. Yeah, that's yeah, also. Hand in the mouth. <laughs> yeah, it's the mouth, wasn't it? As well. I'll put the mage hand in its mouth. Okay. Um, it's it's complete darkness there, so you you can't really put the mage hand completely through because you lose track, you lose sight of the spell, so you can put it partially through. Um, seems it seems fine. There's no resistance. There's, okay. there's nothing okay. behind that. There's like emptiness behind Brave that. Enough. Okay. What, what's this purple stuff on top, anyway? That's the darkness. Oh. The darkness. Also, not Touching like. It didn't do you anything. Purple badness. <laughs> I shove was... my big, long, hard pole in its mouth. Which one? The ten. Oh. <laughs> the good one. <laughs> Genuine question. You've got two, haven't you? So definite. So I mean, the immovable rod. You mean? I think the no, battery no. ram is too big. No, the ten foot pole. So ten foot pole. Okay. The immovable I mean, rod. I'm assuming I have the immovable rod at the moment. Okay, it meets no resistance. Take the pole out, and it seems totally fine. Look at me. 
mess. Oh, it's you could really light it up and then yeah. you can stick it in and see what's inside. You could cast light on the pole. Yeah, so, I'll do it. Well, wait, wait, wait. So our current light isn't shining You're into the talking. darkness anyway, is it? That nope. Oh, is wait, it actually back magical back. darkness? No, the salmon needs to be eaten, please. I believe so. I reckon this is something that we don't need to know about for now. I would so tend to agree. But it's no point in not putting light into it if we got this far. I assume it won't do anything, but... is I suppose light's free to cast, isn't it? Yeah, yeah it's, it's a cantrip. cantrip. Alright, light up yeah. my pole. It's not a cantrip. <laughs> uh, the 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 pole um, bursts into light. Uh, you feed it into the the hole in the front of this the statue the statue's mouth. Um, but as it as it enters the darkness, it's completely consumed by it. The light does not radiate out. It's completely blocked. Okay. Um, you take a pole out, and it's fine. And the light is is still on it. If I, and when it's inside, if I wiggle it about all around, I don't receive re, um, like get any resistance. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> on, there in there? Come on, it's like, like a little goblin sitting in there waiting. Yeah. <laughs> oh, by oh, your hand, oh, like get me. like I'll have that. Because <laughs> uh... I don't want to just push it in and out. I wiggle it all about. Okay. <laughs> Okay, jeez. Uh... <laughs> no, there's, there's no resistance. Cool, there's... okay. Hey, Carmen, uh, you're good with magic. What the f- what's going on here? Uh, uh... <laughs> roll Arcana. Arcana on, on, you know it's illusion, do you want to roll Arcana? Yeah, sure, I'll just, I'll just step forward, just like... Please, yeah, Mickey! Uh... But we know it's darkness. We've all come across darkness before. We have Shut a couple of darkness. Shut up, Tilly! Nothing! I probably know about magic darkness, right? Dark? Yeah. We all know magic darkness. Uh, no. Everything about magic darkness. We can Arcana check. Carmen, you're an, you're an idiot. You don't know anything about magic unless you know the spell. <laughs> uh, okay, so you do know that uh, darkness <laughs> as a spell is something that is. Uh, created, it's something projected. Like when you when you create light, it's magic that is projecting real light. Like right? magic is creating something. In this case, magic is creating dark. So you know that's evocation, not illusion. Okay, Wait, I, will, I will share this information. So there's so, something else doing the illusion, or this is an illusion of darkness. How is that even a thing? God, that's so confusing, isn't it? I say. We forget about it and go go either right or left, and then we need don the mask. Yeah, the they, It's essentially Should telling us we get into its mouth. Mask. What if this guy? What if this thing is going is to be big us? enough? Yeah, uh, go find out. Then maybe put your hand in. I'm not putting my hand in. How, how big is this guy's mouth? I feel like it's obvious to. Put oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You could, you could. Do... Uh, yeah, you could climb inside. Oh Easy. my god! I think I think all of you could could climb inside if you want. I mean, if we get Dragon Bait to just stand next to us and like give us a lift up, oh yeah, God. the, the mouth is wide enough for a medium or smaller creature to crawl through. It seems like an unnecessary risk to me. You said it's Don the mask. That's a that's a mask. I I know what you mean, but the thing is, is that traps are designed to catch people out, and this is something that seems like who is going to put their hand in this by normal instinct i guess sure. go, then go and that's and, why go and do it then. i'm go not saying i should do it i'm saying that oh. it's something to consider do, well do you want to explore the other rooms and come back to this hmm. i Wonder. think that's what this intended what does artist think about this <laughs> would he put his hand in uh no <laughs> Like, no, uh, he he didn't get he didn't get to, to this age putting his hand in random holes in dungeons. I just feel like, are you sure? Because I feel like you're the type to put a lot of things into the holes. Early, early in the temple. Uh, what about like? Has he ever seen anything like this? Uh, uh, but he like I'll maybe I'll just say like but artists you're like really good with high level magic wouldn't you know what kind of illusion this could be because it's not 
actual darkness is it? Um, Since, uh, you know, with my expertise, I can tell that it isn't so. Uh, 